All right, guys, welcome back to Uncharted 4, my walkthrough here on Button Mash Kingdom. Um, so we are continuing this chapter here, having found this tomb for a different pirate, not not um, guys are. Avery. Well, those who prove false, I guess. I think Avery or Thomas too are just trying to scare us. Yeah, Thomas too. Good thing we're so. jaded treasure hunters. <laughs> Good thing. I just got a call, actually, that I'm very excited about. Um, my older brother was helping me look for a PS5 because it's been so hard to find them here in Canada, and uh, he found one for me, and uh, he picked it up, so I'm really excited. I'm going to continue, obviously, finishing off uh, this gameplay for this game uh, and a couple other ones. Um, but the nice thing now is is uh, we're not going to have to wait. Um, we're not going to have to wait for uh, Hogwarts till April. I'll be able to play it. Um, ooh, that's not good. I'll be able to play it uh, with everybody else in a, in a couple weeks, which is great. So I'll be able to do my review of that. I'll be able to do my review of the Horizon Forbidden okay, West DLC because I really love that game. Um, so I'm in a very good mood right now. Very excited about the opportunity to play those games These on PS5. Are clearly not built to code. <laughs> they are. So we'll still finish up uh, Uncharted 4, and I'm playing uh, Tiny uh, Tina's Wonderland, which we'll keep bad. playing. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited for the PS5 and everything that that's going to have to offer for the channel and to just enjoy the video games that are going to be available there. So, um, pretty great, great mood I'm in now having gotten that call from my brother, so. Ugh. Man. The only thing that could dampen my mood is is getting my butt kicked in this game and dying a bunch of times, so hopefully that doesn't happen. I can't make sense of it. Neither can I. I mean, if Avery's trying to hide his treasure, why involve another pirate? Uh, maybe he saw him as a part of his crew. Maybe he sent him one of those St. Dismas crosses. Yeah, maybe two took all the treasure for himself. Yeah, or maybe Henry Avery actually did die, didn't fake his death. Enough. And Tool just pretended to be him or something? I don't know, who knows? There's some, there's some secrets going on here for sure. Oops. Sorry, I was just playing games where uh, that was the run button. That's the problem with playing multiple games at once. <laughs> uh, we're not going back that way. Uh, at least we didn't get dropped in a pit or something. Yeah, this ain't Indiana Jones. This is elaborate. You can hmm. say that. So they've got three crosses. Um, Different design. There are four reapers or skeletons here. That light source reflects and shines on. Hmm. Not another sweet. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the hand out. Whoa. When he made him put his hand in before, look what happened, my Too goodness. Test? Trial? Yeah. And this guy clearly failed. And let's do better. Alright. There's something on the bottom there. It's a bucket. Huh. Okay. Hmm. Now what? What do we do with the bucket? Get water? Get water, put it back in the mechanism, and then the weight will change something. Bucket filled. All I can think of. I pass it up to me. You know, it's kind of funny, as a dungeon master playing tabletop games, you're constantly trying to come up with, like, fun puzzles and stuff for your players. It's hard when they can't see it, though. Like, in a video game, you can see it. When If you don't describe things properly, they're not going to be able to. But it kind of makes me think of how good of dungeon masters would, like... These ancient peoples who set these tombs and traps, they would be amazing at making that stuff. Something with the three crosses? Yeah. I'm guessing we're looking at Jesus... 
our good thief Dismas and the jerk thief Gestus. We want to receive rewards. Dismas, so the black one is Gestus. We want the white cross because we want rewards. So. Oh, we can turn the. Okay. Yeah, because th now we want that to. Oop. Do we need all of them? We have to put them in order. We have to put them in order. So Jesus has to be in the middle. Yeah, there we go. There we go. And then turn this one. Nope. Shit. Never mind. Um, we got to move that one in. There we go. And then... No, I think I did it wrong again. Because that's, yeah, that's where the that one has to be for good old Jesus. Um, but I want it out of the way for now. I don't want it even being affected. Yeah, so I want... Oh, uh, man. Like, in my head, I can very clearly see exactly what I have to do, but it's not... Oh, man. Okay, I just want this one out of the way. Yeah, so I'm going to put that out of the way for now. Um, then I can do that this one at the very end to bring that in. Right now, I want to bring... Nope, I want to bring... I need him to be there. But I need the white cross to be up to his side. So let's do this for now. Bring this. Yeah. There we go. Bring... That in here. And then if I... Oh, one has to be up top. Because this isn't going to cut it. This isn't going to be enough. Because if I do this and bring... Yeah, we... They no, the bucket needs to be... They could. No, the bucket needs to be up top. So... Oh, I want to get these out of the way. Yeah. And now I should be able to crank this so that the bucket goes here. Check it out. Something up there moved when you put the bucket on top. Yep, There's and a then channel running from the mechanism to the door. Okay, so bucket on top is good. Keep it there. I think That's this is. Gotta be it. I think this Let's is right. Right? I hope. Take the look. I think you got it. Oh yeah. All right, see? Oh, what a clever mechanism. Today. I honestly wish I was clever enough to come up with stuff like this for my dungeons. So if that was a test, what do you suppose it was testing exactly? Filling a bucket? I had to know about Saint Dismas, whom I bet Avery and all of his crew were intimately familiar with. It's not that hard of a test. Maybe it's not the only one. I just don't want to miss anything, so I'm kind of going around all, all walkways and areas here. Who did it? All right. Ooh. Oop, wrong button again. I am wasting a lot of dynamite by accidentally hitting the wrong analog. <laughs> all right. Let's go. Alright. Do we... We gotta get up there somehow. Okay. I'm guessing we need to get up to that broken bridge. Hey, come here. I'll boost you up there. Coming. Yeah! 
Go, Sam. Do your okay. thing. I got something for you up here. Use this to reach those handholds on the wall over there. Good call. It's gonna roll down. Yeah. All right. Let's do this thing. Come on. Yeah. There we go. What's over here? Oh, nothing. Just a <laughs> jump point if you missed from the other side. All right. Yeah, sure not making this easy, are they? I imagine it was easier when all the bridges and walkways weren't broken. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're a couple hundred years late. Let's see what's in here. <sighs> I would never do that in real life. You make one Where's mistake my... and you're dead, like... God damn it. This way. I don't know which way through he went. Here. Oh, See all... Some light through here. All roads lead to Rome. Ah, catacombs. Well, when is we at Roma? We're under a cathedral. Noteworthy by the dormitories? Not unless you count some clear. That sounds like Laura experience. Bailey. Have you finished digging by the chapter house? We have, ma'am. The northwest side's a It's not, as well. I don't think, but. And what about for a the second southern there. perimeter? Not yet. It'll take us a day to move the crane over there. Nadine. Make it happen. In the meantime, see what you can dig up about it. I'll send a couple of men over right away. Good. Rafe, any luck with those manuscripts? Can we have a minute? Me updated. Oh, that is Laura Bailey. I was right. She's a very recognizable voice for me now. Being such a critical role fan and seeing her in so many video games, she uh, Did you hear? she's just rocking the South Found African the accent. Area under the cathedral. I did. Have you seen it? No. Why? Because there wasn't much left after they'd finished finding it. My men have been a bit liberal with they the guy. like a hundred well-armed bulls in a china shop. But they've made more progress in two days than we've made in months. Progress. I can't analyze rubble. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'll let them know they need to give you a heads up before they do anything drastic. Or you can tell them to sit tight until I analyze the few clues that haven't been blown up. No, we can't sit around waiting any longer. All due respect, I think I have a bit more experience with this sort of thing than you do. We tried things your way. Bullshit. You've been wanting to level this place ever since we got here. No, I wanted to steal that cross long before it ever even made it to that auction. The same auction where I couldn't have my men around to deal with any surprises. The auction was the cleanest way but to get the cross. But instead of going with my gut, I'll listen to you. And now we have competition. Oh, well, I didn't think he'd show up. Or maybe you wanted to draw him out. <laughs> why, why the hell would I do that? Because you think you need him. And maybe you do. Point yeah. is, I'm done. You ain't to do that good, Rafe. If the treasure is here, we'll find it. And if not, well. Maybe it's time to move on, huh? It's not personal. Of course. I'll let you know if anything turns up. What a dick. Let's get moving before they blow that treasure to bits. Oh, stop making out. <laughs> Wait. You think she was right, though? About what? Rafe wanted to draw you out. As long as he doesn't get the upper hand. 
cares? It doesn't matter. Yeah, it's true. I mean, they were going to go for it regardless, but what they were going to find it, do whatever they had to to find it. it has got to be some side chamber because we're the only ones here. Hmm. I feel like that's definitely going to be a thing for later, but... Don't mind me. Hmm. Cool. I guess later is now. Because <laughs> there's no way that way. Alright. Now remember, no dynamite. L, not R. Whew. Got it right that time. Whee! Hmm. Uh, a little too high to jump up there unless you got a trampoline. <laughs> Left it in my backyard. Oh, darn. Wait, do you, do you have a trampoline? I wish. Hmm. So we gotta get up there. Ooh. Oh. He's got a dangerous idea, laddie. Yeah. This is... Yeah. And there's just enough of a thing there in the wall. And oop. Whoa, yeah, here we go. There we go. Time to walk around in the cathedrals and the underground graves and look for the bodies and treasures of all ye pirates. Hang on. Oh, look at you. How would that not break? break? Up. Thank you, good sir. Definitely getting closer to the cathedral. I don't know what's left of it. Oh, that's where we, we were before, so that was a lot of words to just get across a broken bridge. I gotta say, this is far more sophisticated than I was expecting. Ooh. Me too. It must have taken years to build. That's what it's I'm saying. Like they came up with crazy ideas for this stuff, which is really impressive. There goes nothing. Oh, wait, we're... Oh, I'm jumping. It's a good thing you're not heavier than the crate. Okay. Made it. What's the plan? I'm working on it. We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. All right, um... Hmm. I mean, this is a very well little designed rectangular alcove here, so I'm just going to assume that's where we have to go. Uh, nope. Hmm, okay, so that was wrong. Nathan's dead. I died. Ah, uh, sorry. All right, because we—I mean—that's where we have to go. We have to get to those handholds. But maybe, yeah, I don't know. Here goes nothing. It's a good thing you're not heavier than the crate. Okay. We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work.
I mean, this does seem like the right place to put it, right? I mean... Huh. Are you coming across or not? Could I blow up this with dynamite? <laughs> um... Blocks me. I don't know what to do. Huh. I don't want to die. I'm sure this has to be where I go. Nope. Okay. I am a little bit kerfuffled, I will say. I'm not sure. Uh, that really does seem like the right place to put it, but then... Um, the bridge is out. Gotta find another way across. Alright, I'm not it sure. I... This is almost like when it'd be good to have live stream going, because then people in the chat could tell me how dumb I'm being and <laughs> explain it to me. <laughs> I don't know why I just did that. Um. Okay. We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. You gotta give me a hint as to where. <laughs> All right. Who needs bridges? <laughs> oh no, I I wouldn't mind bridges per se. <laughs> I I would have preferred a bridge because that was painful. How many tries that took me? Can't go through there. So how do we get through? <clears throat> Over here. There was always another path, my puppet. Uh, this place wasn't completely falling apart. We'd probably be trapped again. Nathan, look around you. Holy crap. This must have been another test, but it all just crumbled into the ocean. Well, I guess the test now is how the hell do we get to the other side? Is there any way to get to the beam? Nothing to rope onto. Nothing to climb onto. We well, we could probably drop down from here. Um Ooh. What's this? Let it be known that I, Thomas Howard, captain of the Dauntless, am a gullible fool. It started with the cross, the cryptic, cryptic message from my old compatriot with a vague promise of paradise. I was skeptical, uh, but the thought of living... The remainder of my days at home, wandering what might, wondering what might have been, was too much to bear. Uh, and one does not ignore a letter from the King of Pirates. I survived being marooned off the coast of Madagascar. I survived the attack of East Indian Pembroke, East Indiaman Pembroke. Um, but I will not survive this. My leg is broken, and my crew, too cowardly to set foot in these damn caverns, uh, cannot hear my calls for help. Who could have imagined that my deeds would bring me to here? To die an ignoble death so far from home. May God himself curse you, Henry Avery, and may my ghost haunt you the rest of your days. Huh. This has been trying to read by 
Button Mash Kingdom. I can go twice as high. Take a look in a book. I struggle with simple words. That really safe looking wooden seesaw thing might do the trick. Worth a <laughs> shot. Alright. La la la. la. Hmm. Or we just jump over to that thing? No, we can't. Okie dokie. You ready? You ready for this? Sam? Sam? Come on. Well, here goes nothing. Yep. I gotta move up. I gotta move up. Hmm. I can't move up fast enough to jump. Nathan, Nathan, stop! Ooh, you're right. I was too low, and I knew I was too low. But I'm like, well, maybe I have to. But maybe nothing. we gotta wait for we gotta wait for Sam to do something. Nathan, Nathan, stop! You won't make it. You're too low. But then you jump on. I'll weigh it down. Go. Hey, you think you're that heavy, do you? Just let me look around. Cool. Cool. I'll just hang out here. Check out all that machinery. You know, really makes you appreciate everything that goes into making one of these death traps. <laughs> Don't be glib. something to weigh down the seesaw. Excellent. On the bright side, I doubt his men would make Heavier it that far coming after us. I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah. But I'm sure he'll find a way. There we go. Hey, nice air time. Uh, well, if treasure hunting doesn't work out. Oh, crap. Yeah, nice. Yeah, there's no way they could follow us that way. There's another test down. At this point, I'd rather take another death trap. At this point, I hope we're at the end of this thing. Yeah. Come on. Okay, getting a bit dramatic with the statues here. Seriously, why decorate a treasure burial site or build elaborate tests? I mean, either we're missing something. Avery was really, really bored. <laughs> uh oh. I guess we risk it. Ugh. I'll never get used to this. Ooh, this is cool looking. Just another cross. At least this one has some jewels on it, right? Whoa, whoa, don't touch it. What? Why? Look at it. The only valuable thing we've seen in this cave. Right. This is another test. They're on scale, so you remove... Breathe. This is like the boulder thing from Indiana Back Jones. You, it's weight reactive or okay. something. So... It's, it's gotta be the coins. Yeah. Are you sure about this? Pretty sure. Pretty sure we'll have to do. I just, just one now. Great, I got it. Please don't be a trap. Oh wow, that is cool. It's a map. <laughs> you recognize the shape? It's Madagascar. Look. Star right here. It's King's Bay. Yes, it is. <laughs> Son of a bitch. 
He's screwing with us. What are you talking about? Avery, he's screwing with us. This was supposed to be it, so where's the goddamn treasure, huh? I mean, Kings Bay, great. Well, what's next? North Pole? Outer space? Nathan. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. He, he was recruiting. Who was recruiting? Avery was recruiting. Recruiting for what? <laughs> <laughs> You gentlemen are very, very noisy. Guns on the floor. Slowly. Must have known you from last time. Uh, throwing me out a window didn't do it for you? Rafe. Rafe, come in. I'm at the graveyard. Nadine, hey, we're here. Yeah, I'm looking at them right now. What? Where are you? Come back to the cathedral. Follow the holes. I'm on my way. And for God's sakes, don't shoot him yet. <sighs> Not want to hurry then. King's Bay. Yeah, but, uh, where in King's Bay? You'll need that cross over there to figure it out, but there's only two people that can tell you how to use it. Let me guess. You two. Well, leave it to Rafe. You're gonna be waiting a long time. Sorry, boys. I'm not here to negotiate. Bring me the crucifix. It's not a crucifix. What? Well, technically, a crucifix refers to cross the... You know what? Never mind. Don't touch it! <laughs> <laughs> that was clever. I like it. Shit. Of course. Also, what happened to my machine gun? Come on, man, my assault rifle. Ooh. Man, we really kicked a hornet's neck, didn't we? Yeah, we kicked it, punched it, and set it on fire. <laughs> Ooh. All right. No other weapons to get. I'm really bummed out that I had that really cool assault rifle, and now I don't.
That didn't go well. Whew. <laughs> Getting out of this is going to be a challenge. Ooh, mon ami. Haha. <laughs> I've got... I've got blowy up things too. Oh yeah, here we go. This is what I wanted. We can do this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, I love this gun. Uh, wasn't Victor saying the weather is lovely this time of year? I can't see I don't think shit. I'm gonna get more ammo for this, so I might as well take one of these. way we gotta go, so no. Oh, jeez, that was just bad timing. <laughs> that was so stupid. Oh my god! 
We just gotta get back to the plane. Back to the plane. Come on. Oh my goodness. All right. Momentum. Momentum. If I have to swing two, three, seven times, I'm going to do it. What, the dead guys? <laughs> All right. Take my time. There we go. It only took three tries. here and heal. We're coming, Sully. We're coming. I had a thought the other day, which um, kind of made me sad, and I hope it's not true, but this game is called The Thief's End, and, and it kind of makes you feel like, does that mean Nathan's End? But then I thought, like, I really hope it's not because Sully is going to die. So every time he's in danger, I'm getting a little more nervous because I wish I hadn't thought that, but now I'm like constantly concerned. Um, Alright, how do we... We got to get to there so we can slot... Oh, never mind. There's more. Don't go here. I'm dumb. Just made it. <laughs> Woo. Just got out of there. Wow. That was intense. Well, that was a close one, huh? They shot up my goddamn plane, mate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. Suppose it's a start. You think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother <laughs> just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? Just think about this. Thomas, too, was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. Oh, to create, like, a mass they horde. And hid all their treasure together. Wow. That would make the guns way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. <laughs> what are you laughing about? The people who survived the caves. The recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. Uh, oh, oh. There's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. We 
Look at that product placement, Sony. <laughs> oh man. Hey. Hey, Nate. Hi, honey. Oh, hi. I've been trying to get a hold of. Oh, the classic outfit. I love it. Well, you know the news. There's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. It uh, it grounded us for sure. You know. Had some equipment failure, but you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So, are you gonna start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're gonna need maybe another ten days or so. Ugh, ten days. Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go God, ahead and buy a ticket then? Oh, uh, you know, you don't have to do that. That's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. She's smart, Nate. You're... Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. James. Uh, she's gonna, gonna figure it out. You're a dumbass. Okay. Yeah, she can tell you're lying. Look at her. Love you. Love you too. She was questioning whether or not you were happy with her. You said you were, and now she can tell you're lying and you're saying, taking Victor? off. Like, what a dumbass. No, not a goddamn thing. What, never lose his signal? Paper. We'll wait till we get to a good save point right, here, and then we'll finish off this gameplay episode and start the and next one in Madagascar. Down. Let's get the show on the road. All right. Well, thanks guys for watching. I'm really excited. I love how we're traveling the world and going to different types of uh, some places here. Um, but yeah, we will we will pick up the next gameplay session. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure, fingers crossed.